Hey, Squiddies, it's your late night talk show host, Dre, here from the Tattoo Squid Podcast, here to take you on a deep, dark, murky journey to the recesses of my mind, while I talk to other podcasters about their shows and ask the hard questions, like, when you jaywalk, do you walk backwards or forwards? Or do you eat with your hands and not the utensils? How does one eat hot Cheetos and not crap their pants? All that and more, so take a dip and listen to Wonders. Go to Linktree slash Tattoo Squid Podcast. show about everything and nothing all at once with the goal of bringing a little humor to your day at least one hour ish 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 of your day yeah uh you can like us you can love us or you can hate us we're proof that there there is is a better podcast podcast. Uh, across from me today is there he is and to my right Hi. And I am Sarah. (laughs) We're calling him hi through the rest of the episode. He's high Hi. on candy from last week's app. Yeah. <laughs> He's still chewing on the maum. 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 It's wild. It's nice that we still got some of this left uh, behind. Absolutely. We like to hear from you. Do we? We do. I'm going to say we do. I think collectively we do. And if you want to reach out to us, you can email us at... There is a better podcast at gmail.com. Thank you, D-Lo. And on the Twitter. There is a better, the number one. Thank you, Tony. And on the Twitter. There is a better podcast. So today we're going to talk about. (laughs) Okay. Where in the world was Sarah? She was gone for Uh, a couple weeks. Where the hell did she go? See. God damn it. I was going to do that. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, I love it. Well, she sneaks around the world from the end to Carolina. Never even thought of it. What are you kidding me? Oh, down to Belize. It even has like Berlin it. in there. Yep. I'm yep. just waiting for China, tell me. Where in the world is Sarah? Sarah Speaking of which, the 90s keep coming back. You guys just really <laughs> played into that so well. That's what we do. Yeah. And also, would you uh, would you pay to use the toilet? Let's talk about that. Depends on how bad you got to go. But first, I guess. we have to travel down the ubiquitous word hole. <laughs> <laughs> Dig in. Dig in. So today's word is. Oh, I don't know if I could get this to play. Photophobia. Oh, he, he said it really interestingly. Photophobia. Hodophobia. Does anybody would like? Would anybody like to guess what hodophobia? Is that a means? fear of hodophobia? Oh, is that a fear of hodokatbi? <laughs> I was thinking. That was my first see, I was thinking. It, <laughs> I think it's it's a fear of hodo in uh, Game of Thrones. I was gonna say hodo. that's the one. Hodor. Hodo. Hodor. Hodor. Yep. It is actually hodophobia. Oh, hodophobia that's phobophobia. Is... <laughs> there you go. It is the fear of travel. Oh. oh. It's a fear oh. of travel. Oh, you know, it I... could also be a fear of that newscaster. What's her name? Hoda Kotb. Hoda Kotb. Yeah. <laughs> did, did you already say that? That was the first thing he said. <laughs> oh, yeah. I knew bad. one of those two would hey, come up. You... I knew you would say Hoda, and I knew he would say the one from Game of the Thrones. Game of Thrones. Okay, I, I'd gotcha. recommend Nailed checking it. out the, the show sometime, D-Lo. You might want to listen to it every now and then. It's a really good show. <laughs> what show is that? There is a better podcast. <laughs> oh, I thought he was going to say Hoda oh, Kotb the third hour. I've never heard of that. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. But I know there's got to be a better podcast. There so. probably is. Okay, so first we're going to kick off the recommendation, and I want to really celebrate for a moment the fact that they're bringing back Kids in the Hall. Oh, hell kids yeah. in the Hall, I know we're all a little bit okay. fans of sketch comedy. Okay, I'm, I'm going to say, first of all, you beat me to the punch because I actually had this on my list of stuff that I was going to hit on someday. Oh, well, someday but came. Your, yours is better because I didn't hear about what you've got out here. So go ahead. Someday, so, get, get, somehow, oh, yeah. I'm going to make it all up give, right now. Give the deets. Okay, so this is a Canadian-based comedy troupe. Um, mm-hmm. If you watched it back in the day when it originated, which was 1988, and they had five seasons, um, I... Grew up, I watched it on HBO. It was like a Friday night thing. You always, we had to watch it. Um, and so, yeah, after five seasons, they were just went on hiatus. And apparently after 27 years, 
They're coming back. Dun, That's da, da, da. awesome. So starting May 13th, which is, you know, you got a few weeks if you want to dive in and watch some old eps, the original, the OGs. Um, I'm pretty sure they've got them on YouTube. You can find all kinds of skits on everywhere. Um, but they're coming to Prime on May 13th, and that'll be their season six. Um, I don't know who's playing a, vid- a that song That would be here. me. Oh, can you knock that shit off? I hit some. I'm just kidding. Okay, <laughs> that shit has been knocked off. Well, this, is, this is one of those. This is one of those Canadian exports, if we want to call it an export, that yeah. I think is awesome that we receive from Canada. So yeah. Oh, oh no. We, we've talked, oh no. Don't even. Did you don't, lose what don't you were gonna even. do? Tony and I have chatted about uh, good things that come from Canada every once in a while. Yeah. Uh, we do. We do that. What a couple of weeks ago after Hi. bowling. I'm Bruce McCullough. Oh. So this is. A, I'd like to tell this you. This is one of my favorite about skits. The Daves I know. A boot. A boot. A boot. These are the days I know, I know. These are the days I know. These are the days I know, I know. These are the days I know. Catchy. David Hoffner, he works in my dad's store. He's worked for 12 years. He'll probably work here for more. It's so Canadian. <laughs> he is wearing what looks like a picnic tablecloth as a shirt. And high-waisted jeans. Wow. That's 80s. I've known since I was six. At least he early 90s, late night, late, late 80s. Late, so yeah. we got drunk and sick. These are the days I know, I know. These are the days I know. These are the days I know, I know. These are the days I know. Some of them are David. But most of us are Dave. <laughs> they all have their own hands. They all have their own hands. Well, they have their own But they come from different moms. <laughs> <laughs> So I just wanted to share that little clip with you. It's That's on awesome. YouTube. It's called the it's called Kids in the Hall. Dave's I know. It's a cute song. There's about another eh, minute, two minutes actually left of it. Um, but if you want to go catchy. and check that out, it, really it gets catchy. stuck in your head. I'm telling you, these are the Dave's I know. I think I've been <laughs> singing it a few days now. Um, a few Dave's. A few now? Dave's. Oh yeah. But well, you could well, well. go to um, yeah Amazon Prime. They have a um, they actually have a promo for the new season oh, that's going to be kicking off, and I won't give too much away, but all the players are back. So um, anybody who had seen like Mark McKinney, and they know him from, um, yeah, there it is. Hey, is yeah. that what you were trying to get to? That's what, and no, I told that's you to I shut playing. the hell up. Well, you already had something to go on. So <laughs> This is their theme, theme song. song. Yeah. Shadowy Men on a Shadowy Planet, I guess, is the name of the theme song. There you go. Apparently. Yeah. All right. So yeah, if you know, like, if like you know any Daves. People, Daves, yeah. If you watched um, Superstore. Mark McKinney was part of that oh, yeah. um, of that show. He was also uh, part of Saturday Night Live for and a while. He was, yeah. And I think more the, recently he, he would be he would have been Superstore, and people Superstore, might have yeah. known him from that. Know that much better. And so to see him be in this comedy group is going to be a way step away yeah. from Superstore. He'll be crushing heads, and you'll be wondering why. <laughs> That's all I can say. Oh, is Superstore the one where they were in kind some of like sort a of like, like a Walmart, Walmart type thing? thing? Yeah, I, I yep. started watching that. I lost track of that, though. Now, yeah. I, one thing I didn't notice or didn't realize that um, beforehand was that uh, Kids in the Hall is also a Lauren Michaels production. Oh, really? So there's the tie-in <gasps> to oh. Saturday oh. yeah. Night Live See, I'm, with Mark McKitty being a part of the show. Yeah, and I know we're all big fans of sketch comedy. We talk about SNL quite a oh, bit. A lot, yeah. No, no, never. Okay. You're a big. We, um, we never do what's that. What's the one that you like? The, it's the <sighs> Upright Citizens. Brigade, oh yeah, right? that's a good yeah. one. Yep. Who's oh, in? Yeah. Was that Amy Poehler? I don't know. I get confused between them and the uh, kids in the hall. Honestly, I think you some of the. Not. Yeah, it's it's an age thing. It really is. Oh. I think some of the people who were on <laughs> Upright <laughs> Citizens Brigade were also part of Reno 911 and the show. Oh, the yeah, state yeah, 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 yeah. on MTV. The state. I remember the yeah. state very very well. Yeah, Michael Ian Black. Re- Michael Ian Reno Black. 911 yep. is one of those shows too that I, every time I try to dive into it, I like watching it, but I can't continue. With it, I don't know why. Does it just not pull you? Or is it because it's not like a serial type of thing where it's like continuous? I don't know. I go, I go like four or five shows in, and I'm just like. Then after a while, I'm like, like yeah, I'm good. Okay, okay. <laughs> I've never, I've never completed the series, so um, yeah. There's that. Okay. Well, I yeah. would say mm. if you haven't, yeah. if you haven't yeah. watched Kids in the Hall, yeah. give it a go. Sure. Yeah. It's again late '80s, early '90s. It's literally like either the silliest thing is like the Dave's I know, or it's kind of dark. <laughs> oh, it does yeah, get pretty it does does get at really times. Yeah, dark. Um, Daddy Drink is Daddy one drank. of my favorites. Yes, <laughs> Daddy Drink. Uh, See, you guys can remember these, that and one. I can't remember oh, these. There's so many lines about that. You just can't. and the chicken lady. And I feel like it's one of those things. <laughs> See, I feel like it's one of those things that if I sit down, watch it, I'll start going, "Oh yeah, I remember this." But I, yeah, <laughs> if you had, it, if you grew up with HBO, yeah, yeah, 
you would, you would be more attuned with it. But it's on, and then, it's on and YouTube. And then your parents let you just watch whatever the hell you wanted in whatever <laughs> hour. I mean, it wasn't a reasonable just to hour. to sneak out but... into the, yeah, to watch TV or unless you had your own in your own room then. Oh, no way. See, I was cool. I had my own in my own room. It was a little black and white TV, but mm-hmm. I would also watch Dave Letterman and then I would get busted every time I tried to watch Dave. Oh, just because it was on a weeknight, a school night. Yeah. And it's on at like, what, 11? in the morning. Oh, 12.30. That's right. Yeah. Man, that is. Yeah, that was late back then. I'd was, be yeah. busting my kid. Oh, that's crazy. Yeah. I don't like that. All right. Well, you, you, don't, I like you, to, you do know your kids are probably up at that time anyway. Right? I know. And I'm yeah. too sleepy to even give a poop because I work they're, the next day. Yeah, so. they're too busy <laughs> on uh, looking at freaking TikTok feeds going down the wormhole. I was going to say, they don't even need a TV in their room. Yeah, nope. they don't. They've got their phone. Yep. They, it's nonstop. Everything. I should just take their phones at night. Is that what you're saying? Uh, you know, <laughs> turn off the internet. It's a night. popular opinion. Uh, uh, you huh? didn't hear that from me, kid. Didn't hear saying. that from me. It was all Tony. It was all Tony. Okay. You're welcome. You're welcome. So, so tying back into. Wait, I'm going to try and tap on this. Hold on, wait. <laughs> are, are we going back into hodophobia? Hodophobia. Hodophobia. Right. Um, what the? Uh, what was that? So what, this what did fear it did it of mean? travel. Oh, fear of travel. Fear of travel. Oh. And I guess as I think about that, you know, because a lot of people are going on spring break or they're working on plans for future travel, blah, blah, blah. Those things are coming up. Yeah. And there's all kinds of restrictions and all kinds of new policies and things. And I feel like travel may be like, especially if you're going by plane. I'm not talking like in your own vehicle, you know, by car, but maybe, you know, by either uh, train or by um, plane, train or plane or automobile. automobile. Thank you. No, your personal automobile is a different scenario. Like unless you're traveling with multiple families or something, which I, that's not the case most of the time. Is this traveling, some music? traveling music? Apparently, Ooh. I just did a Google or I just did a YouTube thing and <laughs> just typed in traveling music. Traveling music. This doesn't does sound not feel very like, traveling. This feels like you're going back into the old west, almost like. Oh yeah. Remember the movie Wagons East? Yeah. If you watch it backwards. They actually go west. They actually go west. They're going the wrong direction? They're going the wrong direction. There you go. Um, so anyway, <laughs> so I, I did a little bit of international <laughs> traveling, and I had to say, like, there was a lot of new restrictions. Like, so you couldn't leave the country without testing negative. You couldn't come back into the test into the country without yeah. testing negative. So did you have to do the nose one? We did the nose one. Yep. We did. The, everybody had to do one. Everybody had to test negative in order to go. If you didn't, you couldn't go. Did you and have then, to do the retinal scan as both well? The, both of you have. Uh, both of you have. Both, both of you Both of you have uh, done, done the nose one. I have That's not fun. taken it. I haven't taken a COVID test at you all. You want me to bring you one just for funsies? Yeah, let's well, do it. We I'm curious to know. Does, what, is it as painful as it looks? No. Next week. We'll do one live on the show. Yeah, fuck that. We'll do one for D-Lo. I think it, he's out sick that day. You guys are, <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I've got COVID. Uh, oh God. I'm bringing you a test. <laughs> yeah, you guys are going to test me and you're going to go, oh, it's positive. Oh, oh shit. It, Here we go. Have, so do you have a fear of testing positive? I don't know. I no, you don't. Just, is that posophobia? I don't know what I, that I is. think I'm kind of the opposite. I think I'm kind of like if I'm sick, I don't really, I, I don't know. I just, I haven't even thought about it. Okay. All okay. right. Like I, I seriously have not thought about getting it. Even. Yeah. It's weird. I mean, I you know I'm vaxxed and good, but I just vaxxed and waxed and ready for summer, baby. <laughs> if I'm starting to feel <laughs> gross or sick or whatever, I just go. Eh, it'll be done by the end of the day, and it usually is. There you go. All right. I don't know why. I don't huh. know why either. That's I don't know. Special for you. So special for you. Because but I think you in poured- terms of. Because oh. you poured drinks for today for us, should we be skeptical? <laughs> well, if you want to go get the COVID test, we'll do it. I got a stick. Ain't gonna them. happen. I'm I'll gonna just stick my you. tongue down your nose. How about that? Oh, oh. you're gonna test. Moving you're on. gonna test for something. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I, so I've just for noticed that a lot of people leaving. were having. So not only did you have to test negative, we're te- we're working on all those things. We had to have our vaccination card. We had to have, um, you know, that we were boosted. <laughs> Another one. So you had to have your you had to have your card on you, your passport. Um, you had to test negative so that we could even go right, and then you okay. had to carry around your passport the entire time, which of course makes sense. And then if you're sitting down in a restaurant, you had to have your vaccination card uh, with all of your documentation on it everywhere everywhere you went, everywhere you went. And so just I everywhere guess what I'm thinking like I people roam. are people are making decisions on like Can't you know if they want to travel by plane or by train I guess and so <sighs> I got a sense I got a sense from one of like one particular family that they were a little bit on the fence about going but again it wasn't really related to COVID stuff it had to do with 
the destination of where we were going and the proximity to the Ukraine Russian activity. Um, war that's going on over there yeah, because we were going to trip, Germany. None of that was going on at None the time. of that was going on. Well, the initial plan was 2019 for this trip, so <laughs> it got postponed. Right, right, right. And so not only did, you know, the last time there was a lot of fear around travel, it was like after 9-11. Right. And so right. that's when all those provisions, so you're talking about all the security and then all of the all of the COVID stuff on top of that that we already, you know, we're familiar with doing, but it just felt like it added another layer. Were you guys feeling leery, you and your son? I personally was not, only because, mostly because the um, the so teacher you did not who, have photophobia. I did not, but I knew that there were some some families that did. You know, I mean, I guess it, it's different because I went with my son on this trip versus if I was just sending my son, I probably mm-hmm. would have had more fear for him, just not quite knowing. But but you were going to protect him. I don't know that there's, you know. I mean, you're in the air flying over the ocean. What can you do, man? I don't know. There's not much you can do. <laughs> Just watch the Bond movie and but sit you, back and you relax. you have more fear if he went on his own. You know. I, I would have definitely been more more concerned. Yeah. All right, Mama Bear, move on. <laughs> what was the in-flight movie? Fearless? Oh. So well. there actually was an in-flight. See, I've, I've never been on a plane where there's a movie. So the flight, I don't know what this is all about. Okay, yeah. so the flight from... Because we're in Michigan, to to, right from Detroit to Frankfurt, Germany, was eight and a half hours. The so fact that they had a direct flight. That's pretty impressive. I thought you would have had to take a layover right. in like Montreal or something like that, or you know. Uh, we did have a layover to get to Berlin, and that was a two-hour, and that for an hour and a half flight, another hour and a half flight. So we went from Jeez. yeah, it was an eight and a half hour flight. And then a layover, and then another flight before we got to our destination. And I'll tell you what: after flying like that, I'll I did watch plug. movies. Mm. <laughs> I did watch a mm-hmm. lot of movies. Mm-hmm. Um, they put us on a walking tour of Berlin. So you're flying wow. for like you know you're traveling, which is kind of exhausting in a stupid way because you're not doing anything. Okay. And then you get to your destination, you drop your bags, and they're like, "We're going on a walking tour of the city. Let's go!" Wow, right off the bat. Right off the bat. <coughs> right off the wow, bat. There's we no were, rest I for was, the wicked. I felt like it, one day lasted two days. I didn't know where I was. I didn't know up from down. I felt dehydrated. It was crazy. Now, when you say they, who's they? So we went on an. Ed, it was an educational tour. You know, they so coordinated. So it was is the coordinators of the trip. Yeah, she coordinated the trip, and she she was from. Uh, Munich. So she, I mean, she knew everything, everything of where we were going. She told us history lessons every single time we got on the bus. It put everybody right to sleep. Nice tone. And so (laughs) she told us all the history, how old the buildings were. Like she gave us all kinds of information and we, uh, we were, our heads were exploding by the time it was over. But (laughs) the things that we didn't get, we were on a bus a long time and there's a better a podcast point where you're sitting on a bus for like three hours with no bathroom <laughs> and no bathroom break. It made me kind of reflect on some conversations we've had. I'm kind of getting my items out of order, but yeah. do you remember on episode 33? <laughs> do you remember <laughs> do you episode remember? 33 was? Yeah, I remember. When you're trying that to up. find a bathroom and you can't, you can't get to oh, a bathroom. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. That was it. Okay. So here's the thing. So did you want to go back to episode 33 and insert No, this? no, no. We'll oh. just, That's, we'll just is, uh, play the rest is... of episode 33 in place of this. Thanks for sticking around. There was <laughs> it was a... fun. Go. Go ahead. Dicks. <laughs> anyway. Mr. Dicks. Mr. Dicks. So you, you get on this bus and you're filled with like coffee and water and all the things. And Enjoy. She's like, okay, we're going to have breakfast and then we're going to get on the bus and we're going to have a three hour ride and, and we're going to go. And I'm like, oh, oh my, my God. God. No. I have never had, I thought I had to go to the bathroom before in episode 33 when we were talking about like me and my Jetta. <laughs> no, this was way worse. I was sweating, sweating. I didn't know you could sweat from having to pee, pee so, so bad. bad. That was probably the urination coming out. Oh my just, gosh. Yeah, it was finding a way out. Yeah. I thought I was going to die. It was so <laughs> bad. And then it, let me tell you about water closets in Germany. They're pay toilets. And you have to find them. They're not easily oh. they're not easily found. You have to look for the signage and you have to pay your coins to, to go through the it. turnstile to get to the toilet. I gotta go to the bathroom. Yeah, I was uh-huh. trying to find my change so fast and I was like 
She's like, oh, we've just got, just think of the trees. We've got another 15 miles. It's fine. Jesus and I'm Christ, like, no. I was like, I'm going to die. I'm going to. Think gonna of the trees. Think, just think about the trees. Just think of the children. I'll just relax. And I'm like, if I relax, it's that's going a all problem. over the place. <laughs> like, you don't want me to relax. <laughs> Take me back to America. Show me a McDonald's. Let me go to the bathroom. <laughs> well, and that was the thing. Like, there's, yeah, once you're on the expressway and you're just, you're in it, man. There, it's a long stretch and no there's stopping. nothing there. So we finally get to a gas station and I've got my, I've got my change. Everybody on the bus knows I'm first in line for the bathroom. (laughs) Everyone on the bus is fully aware this bitch has to pee. Nobody gets out before her. Let her go. Let her go. I was literally like unbuckling because they made us buckle ourselves in on a bus. Oh, that's not going to help your bladder. Oh God. I unbuckled. I was like this in the chair, like ready to go, ready to go. launch position. <laughs> and I had my change in my hand, shaking my, my, like my chat, my, like, my face, my hands felt sweaty. Oh no. And I was like, this is the worst. I, I, this is the worst. I didn't even know if I could walk to get off of the bus. And then I finally <clears throat> got there and oh, no. thank God the tour guide asked the driver where is the bathroom when we get there? Because that's the biggest question. That's the biggest question. It is always off the beaten path. It is always like down a stairs, around a corner, or another Where corner. Made, and you're yeah. following little signs that say WC, water closet, water closet. And so anyway, I finally, he's like, oh, you just go straight inside. And I was like, Yay! thank God. Hey, hey. So like automatic doors. I was like, fuck automatic doors. Get the fuck out of my way. Just crashed through, through the door. Yeah, through the it was doors. a me-shaped just hole like in the window. The door. <laughs> yep, it was a me-shaped hole through the door. And I could not plug that change fast enough, and it was. It Don't was tell me you peed on the floor. Do or die. No. Oh, good. No, it was do or die. It was terrible. <laughs> so, did this create uh, hodophobia for you? <laughs> <laughs> uh, no. Because no, sounds I like it would be to me. I would be blotophobia. I'd be scared to travel after that. I adjusted my hydration schedule, though. I'm telling oh, yeah. you right now, I changed my whole hydration schedule based on this knowledge of not having well, access to toilets. That's your <gasps> first problem. You actually have a hydration schedule. Here. I have to. Ha- I had to have a hydration schedule adjustment. I'm, I'm going to back you on that because when Delo and I went to New York, we spent a we spent about uh, what would you say about a week out there at the yeah, most. Yeah, yeah. And we were walking a lot. We were walking yes. a lot. Yeah. Everywhere we go, yeah. we walked. I mean, there were a couple of times we took the subway just yeah. because, you know, you're, you're trying to clear a lot of distance in a short time. But um, majority of the time, though, we, we were not eating. No. We were doing mostly walking, but I was also doing the same thing. I'm like, when's the next time we're going to be able to stop for any, you know, mm-hmm. release, if mm-hmm. you will? It's not going to be a, for, you know, for at least another six, seven, eight hours because we got a lot of shit to see. Mm-hmm. I feel like we sweated a lot of the hydration out of us, though. Maybe because we did. were do- we were doing a lot of walking. We were doing man. a lot of walking. I mean, it was constant. Did yeah. you have the little stepper, the little tracker for how many steps? Um, I had that inst. I had that on my phone. I did not. I was just curious because we were. I know we but were I didn't doing have, like, the walker thing or anything. Eighteen like to that, twenty thousand steps a day, which Ooh. is Jesus. Yeah, we were. Yeah, we were walking every single day. If we weren't sitting on a bus, we were walking. <laughs> I, I would say probably the most uh, in a in a day. I think we got about 13. I counted 13 on the uh, little okay. Apple Health monitor walker dealio. Yeah, I had to change. Ooh. Hello. Hello. I yeah, don't anyway, know what continuing. I did. Anyway. Um, but yeah, so I had to adjust my hydration schedule. Uh, they would have us out every night until about 10 o'clock. And then we had to be up the next morning for breakfast at 630, back on the bus by 730. So I was drinking water. As soon as we got back to the hotel, I would just start pounding water. Yeah. To get myself knew, rehydrated for the next day. And you knew that in the morning you could at least have you, you that, had that ability time. to I have the time. go. Yeah. 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 That's a smart move, actually. Man, it was tough. Was the weather warm? Uh, they're about six weeks ahead of us in terms of seasons. So it was 56. It early, was like 50. Early, it was, spring, it was, yeah. Late, early summer. It was early spring, but it was like, oh. uh, I think it was 65 most days. Hmm. Clear, sunny. Um, so it was, it was comfortable. It wasn't hot. It wasn't okay. cold. Uh, yeah. It was Wasn't in the pot nine days old? It was, yes. <laughs> um, so I guess my question is, I was asking about spring break and all the things, and I kind of dived into a toilet hole. Sorry about that. But <laughs> <laughs> well, that's going to happen. And on the next toilet on the talk. Next toilet hole. Did you guys ever go spring breaking? 
as a younger people? No, I never went. Sp- you I, never went on spring break ever never. anywhere. Nope. Did you ever go on I'm spring break anywhere? I'm not, just curious. Not in the traditional form, no. As an as a I, as I adult? actually went the opposite way. I went up north. You went spring broke. Oh, spring broke. So I, I left cold weather to, <laughs> to go, go to colder weather. Colder weather. weather. Yeah. Was there a reason? Was it like somebody had a place up there? You yeah. Did it was. It was like a, it was. It was like an entire campground, and we had the run of the campground. We just got to do whatever the hell we wanted to at this campground. And it was pretty. It was fun. I wouldn't trade it up. Yeah. But is that considered like off season then when you went, or was it like the end of the yeah, winter? Off, yeah. Well, it's cold. Like end of cold. 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 <laughs> Still cold. Colder. Cold. Um, <laughs> cold does not end I, you know, in I, northern Michigan. <laughs> nope. there, there, there's there's a part of me that still would have preferred to see bikinis and beaches, but uh, you well, know. You can always wear one of them just, you know, I, sit in front I, of the mirror. For I'm not going to lie. I, hot tubs. I, I, sit in front of the mirror. I, I found one in a closet and I, I put it on and wore it around for a little bit. Okay. Is this your. Wore to the hot tub. <laughs> okay. <laughs> She's looking at me like, <laughs> I think you might be serious. <laughs> I think you might be serious. I'm not sure. <laughs> there, was, uh, there was this group I used to hang around with and every uh, Easter, uh, Easter weekend, so they would rent a cabin up in uh, northern Michigan, like really close to the bridge, and it was on the lake. It was like in the Straits of Mackinac, mm. and it would still be cold as hell. Yeah. And uh, like I remember one year I went there, and the snow, it was still snowy, and it was probably about, I don't know, eight to ten inches deep of snow. So I had to park about a half a mile away and walk a half mile to the cabin. But they call it drinking for Jesus. And that was the whole thing of the weekend is you brought as much beer and other alcohol as you wanted. They supplied the food. It was it was, it was just binge. Just binge that wow. whole weekend. And they had an outhouse. That made it even more interesting. <laughs> and um, so you just go out there, binge, drink, and eat until your heart's content. And then just make sure you get the fuck out of Dodge at like 8 o'clock on Sunday morning. Uh, but one year I wasn't there, but the, uh, the host, the guy who put it all together, I think he ate so much meat. He actually formed, um, what the hell is that called when you, uh, this when you eat too some, much? I don't know. This is going someplace. I don't want to know. When you, uh, it's, it's a thing when you eat too much meat and like your, your feet start gout. He, oh. started, he got gout. Oh, wow. In one weekend? Gout from the weekend. No. <laughs> wow. Everything was like overindulgence of meat. Wow. Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, and Sunday. <laughs> That's effed up, man. Stop. I, can't, I, I laugh about it because he's okay. It's fine. But it was just like. What, from one weekend? Uh, so just meat and alcohol. Meat Is and that alcohol. What you're saying? That's it. I mean, it sounds a little bit like a golf weekend. Man. <laughs> but at least, but but see, we I golfed. Say, like, we had some sweat. accidents. That's true. We oh, were walking. So this is just And nothing. running away from bees. Right, right, right. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> speaking of which, uh, I, I sorry, I don't mean to uh, hijack here. I do have a better correction to if you again. might. Oh. Um, I was going to bring this up last week. I totally forgot. But it was when we were talking about do dreams. We're talking about dreams mm-hmm. and uh, how um, I said that it? I had a dream. Um, I had a dream about like these voices and stuff like that calling me. That was actually, that really did happen. Uh It wasn't anything I was dreaming. And then the other thing that I wanted to make a correction on is escaping me at the moment. I had this at the beginning of the show and I totally forgot what it was. So (laughs) we'll come back in the next segment, but we've got a few more minutes to go here. I'll I'll turn it back to you. My apologies. Without point on that one, but going on. No, I think we should. Uh, what, what episode was that we were talking about? Uh, it was with Double D. Uh, we're oh, talking about yeah, the 40, paranormal activity. Oh, okay. 47 48, or 48? 49. Oh, 48. I think 48, 40 49. or 49. One of those two. 49. It was 49. Yeah, last week we just did 50 and then the week before. Yeah. Oh, she right, right, can't right, right, show right. up, but she can listen to them. Whatever. <gasps> I do, I do my best. Hey, you know, what? <laughs> you know the internet is uh, in Germany. I don't, did you know that? Is it? Do is they it? have internet is in it? Germany? I, is it 4G or is it 5G? I'm yet? going to talk about my TV experience and my food experience <laughs> Ooh. after the mid. Oh, snappy snaps. Snap. I didn't even know that that was coming up. But let me go yeah. ahead and get that up for you. I love it. Yeah. I bet Are we doing the mid? Are we doing the mid? Is it time for the mid? It's up to you. Is it too early for the mid? That Are you matter. telling me it's too no, early? No, it's not too it's early. It's never too early for if the mid. If you want to talk about the foods, I can talk about the foods now. No, I think we're just trying to kill time until he actually pulls the damn it's food fighters. Fighters. Okay, okay, he's pulling the pin. We got it's, the bomb. It's food Boom. fighters. Food fighters.
And we're back. Yay. <laughs> Are we doing this? <laughs> yeah, no, I just, and we're back. <laughs> Don't get me started. <laughs> Whoa. Do you go, do you take it some... Take it to the top. Let's All right, go. time to come back in. It's, there is a better, better podcast better. right yeah. here on the Better Our Podcast Music Station. station. <laughs> Power uh, Apple, 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 Apple Station. Anchor or wherever you get your podcast. podcast. Hey. <laughs> Whatever happened to those guys? They retired. They puke themselves <laughs> out of business. <laughs> they're talking into mics in their like retirement homes. I don't know. They're probably, hey, doing, hey. They're probably doing their own podcast. We're like, hey, what's going on? This is DJ Easy Deasy. <laughs> Coming to you from the basement. The basement. Of Tony's. <laughs> hey, we got the basement. Uh, this episode going on here. Giving you a phrase the days. Cue it up and knock it down. <laughs> <laughs> that was Whitney Houston. <laughs> well, Saving we'll the best for love, last. We'll always love her. Yeah. We we'll always love her. You know, okay. <laughs> I just, and yet I love doing it. So, you it's, know, whatever. It is it is kind of fun. I love it. I won't ever say that don't do it. So when you said, can I do it? I'm like, yeah, do it. Okay, so yeah. Tony had, had a correction that he wanted oh, to yeah. address. And, and then he you. had a brain fart. And then, he, and then he quickly forgot, and then now he's back <laughs> at it. Yes, he was back. Back, back again, again with an... Uh, the correction. Tony's <laughs> Tony. back. Hey, hey, Tony's back. Everybody, Tony. I got the soda. Everybody just tuned out. Forty <laughs> got stacks and stacks of wax. <laughs> what does that mean? That means lots of records. Oh, thank you, sir. You're welcome. Enjoy. We're drinking, by the way, um, the rest of the mm. New Holland Holland Mule, as uh, heard in episode 26 with the Stephen Kyle <laughs> Stephen podcast. Kyle. Their favorite. What from what I recall, I, I think it was their favorite, right? Uh, it they was said, tasted like ass, they, which is, uh, they loved it. That, I think that, Kyle, that Kyle actually has a, might have been kinder words than what they use. <laughs> Kyle has a thing with horses, <laughs> so vomit. technically horses and mules, ass, it's all the same. Oh, you're not fond of horses. Horses, 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 horses. 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 Um, so what would be your better correction, sir? Oh, I just hurt myself. Um, that oh was my God, you're sitting in a chair. I <laughs> I know. There's a lot of things that can happen when you're sitting in a chair. <laughs> For the record. Have you especially seen... When, especially when you're drinking you and sitting in a chair. seen the show Sit and Be Fit? I'm just throwing that out there. <laughs> a lot of things can happen in a seated position. So uh, a couple of episodes ago, 49, we were talking about um, paranormal activity, and I was talking about Ooh. one of the uh, paranormal Ooh. actions that was happening in a church that uh, um, it was... I, I said that it was for the movie Poltergeist, but it was actually for The Exorcist. So I was wrong. I You're said it was criminal. Poltergeist. I meant The Exorcist. And uh, that was the movie that they were checking to make sure that the exorcism scenes were done correctly. Yeah, that, that so would actually so make more sense that than make Poltergeist. Sense. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. So anyway, that, that was my other correction. Still, The Exorcist to this day, I will. I'm, I'm sorry. I'll just laugh every time I watch it. Wasn't it? Have on, you watched it? I have. You have. I, oh, okay. I find it hilarious, and it keeps getting funnier. But every single time, time I, I see it. it. <laughs> but I am also the guy. I, I just not in that way. <laughs> I I don't think you've been a part of our paranormal uh, conversations, have Discussion? you? I did listen to the podcast, and the whole time I was thinking, I feel like you do. Like it's just so it's, it's so it's stupid. silly to me. It's uh, so silly, and I, I can't seem to get myself to the point to believe it or anything like that. And yeah. It's just, but I also, there was like, you guys were talking about like what movie made you, um, Barf. no, um, Oop. like it stuck with you and it oh, made yeah, you yeah. like anxious. And for me, it was the ring and oh, I, I didn't get a chance. Like I kept talking at the podcast and like, it's the ring. It's the ring. <laughs> Cause you literally, after you see it in the theater, you're thinking like, well, seven fucking days from now I'm going to be dead. Cause something's going to burst <laughs> through my TV. <laughs> I will have to give that a try. Cause I don't think I've seen that yet. Oh, it's really good. All right. It's a good one. It's good. Did, did I mention one it's that good. made me anxious? I think you just talked. I think someone. Uh, it was the wonderful so. world of Disney. I think is what made you Willy anxious. Wonka. Oh, that kind of yeah. makes me anxious. With is it Oompa just Loompas. the one scene? Oh, I thought you were going to say it was the Oompa scene Loompas. with a boat. The whole the thing. Does make me anxious? Oompa. Really? Oompa. Is it their orange Oompa. faces? They're orange and creepy. <laughs> they're orange and creepy. And they're. Li- <laughs> Do you have a fear of little people? <laughs> no, I don't. Have oh, okay. A fear of it's just Oompa Loompas. Just ones that are orange and creepy. And hang out with a guy that just really should not be hanging out with children. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, runs a Wait candy a factory. <laughs> Although, you know, there are a Strangers lot of OSHA violations at the Willy Wonka chocolate factory. <laughs> to be and, I, and I just, but when you actually think about that movie, that is not a children's movie. That's oh, just God, not something no. that should be happening. 
No, none of it was. And, and I, then you got the grandparents. They're all like swingers in a bed all together. Okay, now let's address grandpa just jumping out of the bed. All of a sudden, okay, all of his muscles are not atrophied. Other that's a whole other conversation, I know, I but know. I think you're onto something there. What a jackass. Yeah, I think they did an SNL skit about that. <laughs> I remember seeing it. It's <laughs> like, wait a minute, you could do this the whole time? And he goes and, and the he kid like, is does like, jumping been, jacks and right, squirrels. Right, and, right. but at the, at the same time, the little boy is like working two jobs. <laughs> He's well, like, Graham, oh, Grandpa's Graham capable? Been doing some oh, shit. Charlie, Charlie, this hurts me so much. <laughs> you got a golden ticket? Well, hot oh, shit down, no. baby. We're going to Vegas. We're going to Disney. Oh, Woo. Me. Give me some bubbles. And Never mind the fact that I have no education. In a world of ocean ah. There it is. It is. Gosh. <laughs> oh, were we doing a show? <laughs> hey, we're doing a show. Oh, so shit. I did want to talk to you about. <laughs> we, I do want to share. Some, we're seriously all paused. Like I know. We're, oh yeah, oh, we're yeah. doing a show. Oh, fuck yeah, we're doing that. Uh, so I sent you guys a picture, and I don't know if I really want to post this on our. Yeah, I don't recommend Twitter. It. I wouldn't, but. Um, I mean, it's good for the meals, it's not bad or no, it's else. bad. Oh, it's so bad. I'm so I dehydrated in this photo. Let me see that again. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold Let on me see it again. <laughs> yeah, you do look a little dehydrated. I'm so dehydrated. Oh, go. oh my That's god, perfect. it's so bad. I can see it. Yep. Look at me. Look at me. I look crazy. <laughs> yeah. Look at me. Look, yeah, you look, look at me now. You look nuts. I am nuts. But that was the intent, and the lady next to me doesn't look thrilled either. So what, we'll, we'll post okay, what it. happened is we'll post it, and then we'll put that smiley face. She actually, the lady next to you actually looks like she's gonna vomit. Yeah. Here's the scene. Here's the yeah. scene. So this is night five, I want to say. We had one, two, three, four dinners. No, three dinners in a row of schnitzel. Schnitzel? Schnitzel. Okay. And schnitzel. So, I'm already going to derail you. I don't know what schnitzel is. That's yeah, sausage, right? It's like a potato, and then it's like oh. a pounded piece of meat, and it had oh. like what Is that what's on like, your plate there? No. Oh, no. Okay. Nope. I'll okay. tell you in a second. We'll, we'll get okay. to that. We'll get to that. That gets better. Oh, hey, yeah. We'll get to that just it in a second. Like, the schnitzel, whatever, it was like meat, and then it had like a breaded coating of what looked like, I want to say, like cornflakes on it. Okay. It's okay. not great. Not a vegetable <laughs> in sight on your plate. Not a vegetable in sight for okay. days. So like, you know. So you're going to get into vegetables. I'm telling you, I'm dehydrated. <laughs> I haven't had a vegetable. I'm not well so you're by looking, day five, okay? <laughs> so you're, you're looking for gout is what you're saying. I'm <laughs> you're fishing for gout. I'm, I'm actually, whenever we had free time to go walk through the market, I'm like looking for fruits and vegetables because and based, based and they on, them there. Based on what I can tell, they don't really seem to have a lot of cheese on their plates either. No cheese. Really? Yeah, and there was no yeah, dairy. I don't think I, I could function I, in like, Germany. There you go. That, yeah. that would be my thing. I, I can survive yeah. without the vegetables. Yeah. But if you got no cheese, man, that, you're- There was I, yeah. I cheese. I think, the, I think for the tour that- they tried to come up with meals that were made it more affordable and that oh. kids that are high schoolers would eat. And so the meals were a lot of just meat and potatoes. And so <laughs> the picture I'm sharing with you Okay, is when you're saying they, again, you're talking the about- group, The tour group. The group that so the group said that everything arranged the Germany, tour. Germany, from yeah, yeah, Germany, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. said this- This, this is, is what a, American kids will eat. And I'm trying, I can't come up with a good German accent, but that's what I'm envisioning. Well, Elizabeth told us <laughs> this was the <laughs> this meal. This is what the this children is eat. What this is what the children in Germany this is what the children eat. Will yes, eat. Yeah, eat. that they will okay. accept is meat Zip and potatoes good. and yes. like a little bit of gravy. Like a little bit of gravy. Oh, wait, you can't have too much gravy. Not a vegetable. We not, not put a lot of gravy on no, it. No, just no. a little bit. It's the schnitzel on it's your dinner. It's the schnitzel. So okay, yeah, everything is meat. Dino, you like the, Dino, you like the schnitzel <laughs> on I love the schnitzel. You like, you like the... <laughs> <laughs> you like the, the gravy on your wiener, don't oh, you? Oh, I'd ah. take a little bit of gravy you on that. A little, wait, how did, wait, how did you become uh, I don't know. I don't Irish. know where you guys are going. It was so, Irish. So, I went to the Irish. <laughs> <laughs> that was Irish, it was. So the meal yeah. upgrade we got, we went to this <laughs> pub, which was oh, established in, hold on, I have the beer coaster. It's Irish, it wait, is. I, I've been trying to figure out your bag. What the hell is? Uh, I'm going to tell you all about this oh, bag. Okay, there's too. more to that. Jeez. Right. There's more to everything. I'm like oh, getting no, ahead awesome. of the game on everything here. So okay. this is the place we went to. I'm not going to be able to say this correctly. Uh, I'll let you look at it. But it was established. I'll, I'll take a shot at it. It was established in, what's the year right there? 13? 1965. Uh, no. 1328. 1328. So that's the place we went wow. to for dinner. And okay, it's so a this is big. Augensteiner Bra. 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 Bra.
Great. Now here's the beer on the back. Try oh, that fuck one. Me. <laughs> beer. <laughs> fuck me sideways. <laughs> My kids aren't listening to me. Okay. <laughs> Go ahead. I just like the munchner. <laughs> Munch. She looks happy though, right? Oh, I bet you do. <laughs> munchner. <laughs> beer? Beer. Right. Beer Fixin means. Butt. Fixin, Fixin butt. butt. Fixin butt. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry to the one German listener. Munchner bear. 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 Is that beer. how, how do they say Do they say bear? Beer. Beer. And that was. Um, Munch established uh, four, uh, well, yeah, thir- uh, 1487. <laughs> Columbus so the sailed the ocean. You, can't, you at, can't even read the numbers now. The <laughs> because you've been trying to too many German. umlauts. This means gra- uh, founded. So this gug- oh, God. Guggenheim. Gagrunde. <laughs> Gagrunde. 1328 right. is founded. 1328. And then the beer itself was 1487. Okay. And so um, that's a game. <laughs> You have to flip the coaster. That, that's oh, a game. You put the coaster game. on the edge. That's a game. Yeah, you have to put the coaster on the edge and flip it with your hand. With your hand, and then catch it. And okay. then, if you are successful, you have to stack another one on top and do it again. Oh Jesus! It and then, gets, do you have to catch both of those? Yeah. Oh okay. And yeah. How, up to how many? Doesn't matter. Well, someone did. I think eight or nine. Wow. Okay. But it actually does get a little bit easier when you add more because it's it's heavier. But it's this a is not a weighted. drinking game. Oh yeah. Well, I mean, everything <laughs> was a drinking Probably not game. Okay, that's what I was wondering. So, um. So yeah, the the restaurant. This is the restaurant we went to. This Brau Munde. I'm not saying it right. I, but anyway. I like the beer side. Has this like very demure <laughs> or, or this lady. It's, I don't even think that that's the right she adjective. Looks happy. Uh, she looks happy. She just looks very innocent. And have some beer. So demure is not the demure? correct. Yeah, that's yeah, that's not the correct right. adjective. Adjective. So um, adjective. Okay. So the upgrade meal that we got because the kids were complaining. No more schnitzel. Is and this 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 goes back to the picture you showed us. Is yes, it goes back to the with picture. you and your near vomited induced friend. Yeah, she's looking really happy. This is a pork knuckle. Uh, uh, mm. Okay, now we get now he's interested. Now he's again? interested. Yeah, let me take a look here. This is a pork knuckle. Thought of a bitch. And what's under it, it on the plate is gravy, and then the the round circle that's Augustine. next to it. I'm gonna, we're going to be able to post a picture of at least the meal, the plate. Grunded, is potato, but I'm going to tell you right now, the way that they prepared that potato, you could cut it, it in fried. half. It looks fried. It's not fried. It's in some kind of gelatin form. Ooh. I cut it in half with my with my knife, and it was just too perfectly half, like, you know, if you cut a sphere in half, it's like, <laughs> bloop. And then also, the gravy did not penetrate Ew. What do you mean? It, like, like you couldn't, you couldn't sop, sop it up? It. You couldn't sop Blah. it up Wait, with so a potato. I, so I am looking it was still at a, the same a slab spongy. of meat <laughs> and a potato. Yeah, the meat's on the bone. <laughs> on an ice pond of gravy. On a pond of gravy. Ice I'm, ice sure, I'm sure it wasn't ice, but It's like a little thick, pond. like ice. No, it was actually very watery. It was thin. Okay, so it was thin. A watery it's grave. Thin. Of... It's real thin. And then yeah. also, I want you to be able to admire... The top of the pork knuckle is just all fat. So it looks like a giant pork rind. So I was able wow. to lift up the top layer like an effing toenail. Oh, God. <laughs> that was so nasty. That's it. I'm out. <laughs> and this, this, this plate that I'm looking at, this is intended for one individual to That's eat? That's one person. It's a good now. It's on the were bone. Were you planning your bathroom trips around that as well? Uh, so the funny part of that, I have a feeling that you're going to make a lot of. That. I was I was sitting at a long table and I was all the way to the back at the wall and I was like, well, I'm not getting out of here alive tonight. <laughs> so now I will tell you that behind us, because there you can see there's plexiglass behind yeah, me. Yeah, I was going to actually just look at that. Go ahead. We've got two. Uh, we've got plexiglass on either side of us for COVID, which is whatever. Okay. Um, the two tables behind us are all the kids. Um, my son is at the furthest table, the loudest table, who are now playing this flip game. With the coasters. W- because the waiter had just brought two fresh stacks of a hundred of these little oh coasters. Oh, my God. Put, and put them on the kids' tables. The kids. Yeah, that's Woo. a great thing for kids to get. And so they're kids. getting. Your night's over. They're getting so loud. <laughs> they're getting so, so loud. And they're really excited about this meal. Stupid Americans. <laughs> you know what's funny? The louder they got, it didn't matter because it blended right into the oh, place. Okay. Well, so they were case. actually fine. That's what fine I, the say, I would assume that based on what I'm seeing there, it looks like it'd be a pretty loud medicans. place. It was yes. a loud place. Okay. And then my son and then several other of him at his table decided to pick up the pork knuckle by the bone 
and just be total barbarians about it <laughs> and eat it I, in that form. I am oh not going to lie. God. I probably would have done the same. At the age? I mean, he's 14. At he went for it. My he age, had a good time. I probably still would have done that. You probably would have stood way up I, as He-Man. I, it is the only way I could see eating that. I mean, it's it's recalculous. <laughs> it looks like it should be at uh, Renfest. It should be. It should be. And it I don't know. Like it 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 Maybe looks, it is. It looks like a Renfest meal. Doesn't it? Yeah. It's. It had that vibe. It's. It's. it's yeah. <laughs> a very <laughs> medieval it's vibe. It's ruckin' fidiculous. Yeah. Yes. It's ruckin' fidiculous. Um, but they, you know, sh- our tour guide, Elizabeth, Elizabeth, who was like the tiniest little thing, wisp of a woman, very cultured, very like Eats sophisticated, three ate plates. the whole three plates. plate. <laughs> Jesus she licked Christ it clean. Of she Latter-day was Saints. so excited about wow. this meal. Wow. Oh, God bless her. You know, she was super jacked <laughs> about this you, meal. Not so much. Did you get um, through the did plate? Did you see what my plate looks like? It didn't change it didn't much. Change. It didn't change. <laughs> it didn't change much. I went to bed very hungry that what, night. What about oh. your compadre there? Oh, she did not partake much. No, I think she ate about as much as me. Okay. Oh, yeah. that's too bad. The people, the rest of the people at the table, they did fine. Yeah. It was, uh, it was, uh, different. It was a learning experience. Yeah. That their meal. Yeah. Did you eat any of the potato? I tried it. I definitely tried it. I and was just surprised. Is it like hard the as a texture? rock or something? Still tastes like a potato. Spongy. It was a spongy texture. Wait, how is so, it spongy, so like a, but it doesn't sop up like a dumpling? Like a dumpling? Like a dumpling? Like, yes. Okay. Yes. Dumpling yeah, makes sense. Yeah, it just kind of like all, the, all the liquid just repelled. <laughs> like I don't know how duck. else to describe it. And I was like, Gross. and it didn't taste like the texture was just a little odd to me. So I was like, well, that I tried it. I, I can completely agree because I hate dumplings, so. Yeah, and the soup that came before, I had a very, I shouldn't have asked what kind of soup it was because it all, by knowing it, it just made me go, well, I'm not doing that shit. <laughs> it's um, the soup of the day. <laughs> that was, I wish she had just said it was the soup of the day. Pancake soup. It doesn't sound bad. I like pancakes. So what they did was they take what raw was, eggs and no, then they no, no. beat them up and then they serve it to you it in, was like a pork based broth wait 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 wait, wait. it smelled has like nothing to do with smelled like pork that's, wait that's i'm nothing, getting there okay. i'm getting okay. there and so what they did was they took what looked maybe like a crepe uh-huh. a very thin pancake uh-huh. and cut it into strips and put it into this broth and that was your soup <laughs> and they put it in front of me it's it was had an odor to it and i looked at it i was like Damn it! I can't even do the soup, <laughs> no. and I'm like, I'm picking up these strips of pancake, and I'm like, oh man. Tony knows me well enough bites, to know that, that I would not have survived in Germany with you at all. <laughs> I would have starved yeah. myself. You would have loved the markets. The markets I, were great. Oh really? The dinners uh, were garbage. Yeah, the markets were fabulous. I have other pictures of. Like I would have starved because I am such a picky eater. There's yeah. no way. No, it There's makes no sense. way. There was um. We were in Munich Let's on the last day just to share with you. There's a sex <laughs> store. I, I actually just had a conversation yesterday with my brother because I, I don't really care for uh, Chinese food. And he's like, why don't you like Chinese food? I was like, they don't have cheese. I mean, that's it. That's, that's all there is to it. This is one of the storefronts. That's just too, that's and just inside sad. there are, it's cash only. Ah! It's cash. It's cash only store. <laughs> I didn't take a picture of inside the store, yep. but this is during the day. Made for fun. Made for fun. Are you describing that or what? So this yeah, is a picture of. Um, it's More by the co- a color of rainbow of um, dildos. <laughs> I know, like starting that from got pink, it in a rainbow. It's, it's going beautiful. to red to Roy yellow, G green, Biv. blue. Yes. And this is a, this is a public advertisement. Go, it's out. This is a stand that's out on the street during the middle of the day. Which I don't have a problem with because I think that's healthier than what America does. And then the storefront itself, you can look in and it's got, you know, mannequins with different, you know, attire on them. Mm -hmm. Different fun, you know, things for people to shop and buy. And you can see everything that's to purchase in there. But yeah, it was. uh, See, I can appreciate that part portion of German culture. It reminds me of my favorite storybook character. It's the way I think Americans should be. Americans should be more open about sexuality. What? Look down in this corner. So this is another, like just, we're just walking through the market. This is the same area of market. That is a lot of fucking meat. Now, are you seeing the pig face? (laughs) I think we just found the title of this episode. (laughs) Are you seeing the pig face? That's a lot of fucking meat. meat. What am I? Oh my. Like, (laughs) (laughs) Uh, 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 Yeah, they spare no part of the animal, and so when you're walking through just (laughs) the town, and you're looking through all the shops and things, there's a whole like butcher shop right there. There are four of them. Oh, did you see this? Did you see this just to the 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 snout? Is this going to be the snout? Oh no! Check out the very right side of that. 
Those are some those are some uh, pig legs. Ah. Yeah. How do you like me now? Yeah, bitch? there's the pig hoof. They spare no parts. So all the parts are represented <laughs> of the animal. God. And they get very offended if you waste them. Yeah. You know, because they don't like to be wasteful. They don't want to waste it. That's an American tradition is wasting shit. Oh, I will straight. say the guy that was behind the window of this Curtain? particular shop, he yeah. um, he had a, like the white butcher's coat on. Full of very blood. manicured, like beard and mustache. And he was like, because <laughs> I'm sitting there looking in the window and he's like, Pointing, looking like at it? me, do you, would you would like you anything? Like some food, yeah. You know, his, his smile, and I'm like, oh, I'm good, thank you. Um, this is like normal stuff, like so big okay. sandwiches and I'm not gonna lie, I like kind of wish you'd taken a picture of the butcher now. <laughs> I wish I had too, but I didn't think he'd appreciate me taking a picture of him because he was you behind glass. Asked, you could have asked him. He was behind glass. I didn't want to like. Wait, wait, they protect their butchers like behind like bulletproof glass, not like that like, kind of glass. <laughs> But no, it was like, like a, like like a, a shop, glass. and then you point, and then they get you what you want, and then you pick it up at the window. Um, but so this what is am like I an open market. Here? This is just like a regular sandwich shop. So they do I mean, have I'm a bunch of sandwiches. This stuff looks good. Yeah, so they had a bunch of stuff that was obviously more accessible. The breads were good. They had pretzels for days. I mean, and they also had um, uh, ice cream. Yeah, these are good looking Everywhere. sandwiches. I'd, I'd probably eat one of those. Yeah. They the had breads, ice cream everywhere. Ice cream was everywhere. Ice Apparently, the Italians everywhere. came over and they brought ice cream, and so now there's ice cream everywhere. Hey. The kids got spaghetti ice. I don't know. It's ice cream. I didn't have any, again, because my my innards were just going crazy. Bonkers. Bonkers. And you were dehydrated. Real, and I was dehydrated. I was real. I was real. It's a real good time. It's a real mess there. It's a real, it's good a real time. mess down there. Uh, you want to, yeah, yeah, this there's your problem. So I'm going to do, uh, so we ended up, we started in, oh wait, we started in Berlin. Oh. Then we went to. And now we're here. Dresden. Then we went to Nürm- Nuremberg. Bomberg, Nuremberg, Munich. And then we ended up. Let me see if I can get it. I'm waiting. In the Alps. Walter. Yeah. <laughs> what, what are you doing, yes. man? <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Every single here time. You go, Larry. You see what happens? You see what happens, Larry? <laughs> you see what happens? Not oh, great. <laughs> this is what happens, Larry. You see what happens, Larry? You see what happens when you find a stranger in the yeah. house? There it is. <laughs> <laughs> you see what happens, Larry? You see what happens, Larry? <laughs> this is what happens when you feed us. Scrambled eggs. <laughs> oh, what scrambled eggs? Scrambled eggs. You feed them scrambled eggs. So what, was it was it feed a stoner scrambled eggs? Can we hear that again? Okay, are you able to get back to that part? Is it was it feed a stoner? I got it. I got it. Hold on, hold on. Scrambled eggs. When you feel scrambled eggs, are you sure it wasn't? What happened? I'm doing the closed caption. What happened? Yeah, go back, go back again. When you okay, okay. feel scrambled eggs. That's what happens, Larry. When you feed scrambled eggs. When feed them scrambled eggs. Feed to somebody something scra- oh, scrambled eggs. I don't know. Feed, feed, feed a stoner with it's, scrambled eggs. You would. There was, <laughs> Damn straight I would. You were, you and were, I would love those fucking scrambled you eggs. Were yeah, yeah, you were dropping words in there. He, it, it literally said, <laughs> feel the scrambled eggs. But I think what he meant was feed, feed them scrambled, scrambled eggs. eggs them it's scrambled a eggs. Fight a... Uh, a stranger in the Alps, right? <laughs> um, so we ended up in the Alps. You fight a stranger in the Alps. We did and then fight strangers. Scrambled eggs. We did fight strangers. Did you feed him scrambled eggs? No, I did not feed him scrambled eggs. Well, Good you job. didn't. Okay, go back. But we had a small no, fight. No, she she was right because you should not feed say? them scrambled oh. eggs. Strangers. See, otherwise, otherwise, somebody comes by, smashes up your fucking car. Okay, I don't I don't listen to rules very well. Obviously, <laughs> what were the rules? <laughs> so yeah, we ended up uh, having a snowball fight. In the Alps, it was. <laughs> That's awesome. Actually, That's a cool. lot of fun. Yeah, nothing. I mean, the snow was so packable. It was fantastic. We were, oh god, at the top of Zugspitz. 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 And the elevation was twenty six ninety three. I want to say. Jesus Christ of Latter Day Saints. We're only about eight hundred and ninety here. Did in, you see uh, the prices right, guy? The state of Michigan. No, <laughs> right, yodeling guy. <laughs> 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 there were shops, but no, I did not. <laughs> Damn. Dang it. <sighs> um, so yeah, that was that was a lot of fun. It was amazing actually the technology just to even get up to the top mm-hmm. of the Alps. Um 
And then of course we took the train. Right. We so, took the train back down. So we took a. <laughs> <laughs> so were they yeah, like those little carriages, like 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 the same you would find at a ski lodge? Is it's it- like that, except on steroids. The technology is amazing. The cables are like huge. Okay. <laughs> I can't even right now. Um, and then we got to do the a little bit of the um, like a museum just to kind of show where they came from, which was exactly like this guy. Oh really? I mean, a little bit, yeah. <laughs> Wait, there was were little he wearing guys the shorts? In buckets, little guys Did in he buckets have with like my, with like you know a little flashlight. Leader They Lederhosen. were wearing leader hosen. Well, they're. I mean, it's freezing up there. They can't be wearing quite that, but <laughs> but they're definitely. There you go. Let's paint that picture. He's got shorts on. He's got short, a little hat. A little hat. With a feather. Did he have the pickaxe? He's got a pickaxe. A pickaxe, right? Just his clawing his way up the mountain. Shoes yeah. brought to you by Doc Martin. <laughs> <laughs> That's Dr. Martin. Oh, sorry. Zin Dark Zin Dark Martin? I don't Dr. know. Dr. Martin's I... apparently are back in. Dr. Are Martin. They? Yeah. Oh, okay. That's what well, I'm he hearing goes from by the kids. Dr. now. So, um, but yeah, the technology just to be able to get that contraption up the mountain. Um mm, I wanna say she said the winds could be up over two hundred miles an hour. Holy wow. for sure. Fucking A, yeah. are you kidding me? And so and that's safe. there actually was an ice hotel. Up there, which was made out of snow. Was Superman there? Wow. Yes, he was. <laughs> yeah, I missed him. Um, <laughs> Only met Clark Kent. They don't get to do it. They don't get to make it. They won't be able to make it every year. But when they do make it, it's like, uh, I've got pictures of it. There's little monsters and like little rooms. And you can go to the bar and do shots and stuff in this and frozen all, hotel. And it's all made of ice. It's all made of snow. Okay. It's snow. It's not okay. ice. That would be clear, I guess. But no, sure. it's made of snow. And they were able to do it this year, so that was pretty cool. That was special. Oh, yeah, pretty special. special. That was interesting. Yeah, it's very special. So I didn't feed anybody scrambled eggs, but we did have a fight in the Alps, <laughs> and they were able to go sledding now, down the mountain. Now, That's now, nice. have you gotten through all your stories having to do with Germany? I do. Okay, because tell me a story. I, do you no, 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 no. I'm, I'm, I'm going to guesstimate here. It sounds like if I was to put a percentage on it, ten sounds like. That you tip them. Seventy eight point thirty seven <laughs> percent of your trip was enjoyable. That would probably be fair, I guess. <laughs> I'm asking I mean, you. I'm asking you as much as I'm saying this is what I'm saying. Yeah, I think I think the kind of the downsides Cause, cause there didn't, sound didn't like outweigh always the good, good side. No, there was plenty of good. A okay, lot of okay. good. I don't even mind. I mean, you got to spend time with your kid. That's always I good did, no and, and I got to meet him. It's good. <laughs> some new people and see obviously some Sarah, different culture Sarah's I'm always up for of Germany. it <laughs> right my ver- <laughs> so the other thing is like it w- if you were doing this on your own seeing that many cities yeah. it would take you years yeah. it would take you multiple trips yeah so to be able to see that many cities and see the da. highlights it was da. fucking da. great da. so I, on that level I'd give it you know a 90 okay it's just the, the dinner was the downside but it was okay. So, so I was, I was a little else, bit low on my percentage. So, so you'd give it a little higher than that. I'd give it higher. Everything I'd give is it like great. an 87. Everything okay. is great except right, the food. The di- so just well, the don't dinners eat they- there. No, 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 no. Period. As no, an American, no. don't eat well, <laughs> in Germany. <laughs> I mean, again, I, you go, I didn't actually. Don't let the attraction to tour I pick your dinner. I didn't try the sandwiches she had on her phone, mm-hmm. obviously. But those looked pretty freaking awesome. Yeah, and you like, can, yeah. I, I would I would be down with You'd that. You'd rip into those sandwiches? Yeah. A lot quicker yeah. than whatever the hell that dumpling slash <laughs> oh, meat do. gravy dish you had going on You know, was. and that's the other thing. A like We didn't massacre. get to see the full menu. So I'm sure there were other things on the menu if we had There's access to the hamburger. menu that you could pick whatever you want. <laughs> Our, I mean, my yeah. my my general uh, viewpoint or... or, or, or Take away? Malaise. No, 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 no. no. Experience <laughs> know, with for. German food is is that really, in my opinion, it stinks. Like it yes. smells funky. Yeah, there's a lot of uh, cabbage though. I mean, that's the beauty cabbage, of but, Italian um, food. Italian food. Oh, oh man, smells good. You can't oh, go yeah. wrong. Mexican wrong. food, good. Very good. Uh, yeah. yeah, but German, even Chinese Ugh. food, I will say a lot of the time smells good. Even though I do not like Chinese. I was going to say that's you fine. don't like Chinese food, at but all. it does smell good usually. Okay, like it, I mean, I'm not going to say that every time I've been into a Chinese place that I'll buy that for a dollar. But, and even being there, they're like, like, our Italian, food is bad. Every time I walk into an yeah. Italian restaurant, I'm like, oh my God, I'm ready. And you're to like, where let's, do I let's begin? Let's do this shit. Give me one of everything. Give me the Wiener yes. Schnitzel. Give me everything. Yes. The so, um, yes. so no, yeah, it was a lot of fun. <laughs> and public transportation was solid. Even paying for the bathroom wasn't a big deal just because. Pretty clean? Well, that's the thing. Staffed. Okay. Oh. And always, so always being clean. Always clean. Always yeah. being clean. Mm. 
So, I, I mean, if you're paying 50, the equivalent of like 50 cents to go to the bathroom <laughs> well, every were, single time. How were the women? Were they good looking? Jesus Everybody Christ, was trimmed. Saints. Everybody trim? was trimmed. Really? Yeah. They, I mean, I didn't see a fat I mean, I mean, the German stereotype person. for <laughs> Americans uh, as a German is butch. Okay. Gruff. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Lumberjack. I, say, da, I don't know. I don't want to say anything negative. I, oh. I will say that when we were there, it's before, tr- it's before like tourist season. Mm-hmm. So this was like just everybody that we saw was everybody that lived there. So oh. everybody was like local. Yeah. Um, right, well, and it go. was the coolest part was like you'd go to the town at like two o'clock in the afternoon. Everybody's just walking around, man. But yeah. isn't that everybody's some, walking around to my to my on, on a, a Wednesday? Week day. On I a have weekday. video. Wow, really? I to have my video. understanding, though, in the German culture, especially with work, is they they start early. Now the only the only place that's open before any other work starts is um, bakeries. Because sure. they typically will go Makes and sense. you know buy baked goods, but they're or whatever, only bring open for so to, many hours. They and, bring it to market, and then they're probably right. done by the afternoon. Yeah, and then for those who are working, they take like an hour lunch or two hour they lunch. They sure do. They take a huge lunch, yeah. and then they even take a nap for that matter. They're walking around. And then they around, walk around, they walk relaxing. it off, and then they go back to work for yeah. like a few more hours, and that's it. And that's, that's the end it. of their day. Wow. Yeah. It yeah, would be I, nice to. Do I think they have like a, a day less than us. Considering that we only do like an hour of podcasting. I think it's like a week, 32 so hour work week. I don't know. I'm not 100% sure. But also, um, oh, I just forgot my other point. But yeah, I think their work is their work week is shorter and they have a different philosophy about work. Like we have work. What is it? Work? 40 hours a live week. Live to work, work to live. Yeah. That kind of thing. Yeah. Yeah. Live so to yeah, podcast, podcast go. to live. Do we have time to go to the mall? Uh, yeah, I think we do. Let's do it. Let's go to the mall. Are you afraid to go to the mall? No, I'm just wondering where you're going with this. Do you have hodophobia? <laughs> <laughs> Mollophobia? Mollophobia. Oh, we're already way over. Yeah, we <laughs> that's fine. Time. Let's go to the mall. Let's do All it. All right. Can I tell you? I went to a mall last two weekends ago. Mm-hmm. Guess what I got? Guess. Uh, I want you to guess. It's syphilis? not what's in my hand. Fuck you. <laughs> hodophobia. <laughs> you're the one that said guess. <laughs> Who guesses syphilis? Syphilis. <laughs> when you, someone says... What did, well, I, I, was what did I get at the mall? Well, you could have said Hep C or something. <laughs> oh, of <laughs> course. Hep C. Uh, or, you or, know what? Or you're right. I, I overstepped my bounds there. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Diet Hep C or even Mountain Don't. Mountain Don't. <laughs> Uh, I am going to guess you got uh, something from that plastic jewelry store, whatever the hell that oh, thing like is. Oh, like a Claire's or something? Uh, yeah, Claire's. Go. I got a CD. No. A actual CD. CD. An actual CD. When Th- was the last those time? Those still exist, huh? That's wow. what I said. Was it at uh, Hi-Fi or whatever the hell that was? It was like a Does regular. Does that still exist? Like a regular CD. Okay. <laughs> but so it was a new. CD quality sound. It was a brand new well, release of like, uh, yeah, it was a brand new release of okay. a band. Of an actual band. Yes. That and I was like, wait a minute. And their song wasn't There's Do Host Part 4. No. No, no, no. New host. Oh, wait. So you were at a mall in Germany. We were at a mall. And, and oh, this. I'm sorry. No, okay. Locally. All right. There, there we go. Locally. Locally. Oh, so this has nothing to do with Germany. No, no not I'm at out all. of Germany. We're, we're I'm done. local we're, we're done oh, Okay. Germany. Well, in that sorry. case. You asked me if I was done yeah, traveling, and I said, fine. yeah. We're, we're, and that's why I said, do you want to go to the mall? Yeah, we finished up with Germany <laughs> after I guessed. And you asked me if I had syphilis, and I said, incorrectly. no. <laughs> and now we're caught up to speed. No, I didn't ask you. You said to guess. And I was guessing you had syphilis. Odd fucking guess. Um, so yeah, I got Whatever, a CD, FC. and then I also got Mad Libs, Dun, da, da, da. like hard legit. copy, legit Mad Libs, if you wow. can even legit. stand it from like a bookstore. Now, wow. I know that we've played Mad awesome. Libs. Let me see one else. Yeah. Well, take your pick. I got three. I got three. One of them is called, should I announce them? Yeah, go for it. Hot off the presses, Mad Libs. Ooh. Grand Slam Mad Libs. And Dilo, what's the other one? Uh, this is Mad... Ooh, my favorite, too. Mad Libs from Outer Space. There we go. Oh, hello. So, Dilo, I think we should do one is this the, just to roll Is this roll the out legit the price, too? Yeah, those are the prices. I think that's you fair. You want to do it? All right. I think that's, that's right. completely fair. Dilo's going to pick a page and call up the words. Do you want me to Let's just pull something off random, yeah, or pull. you want me to start right from the beginning? No, don't start from the beginning, because we did some. Oh my goodness, this is... We actually did some. Wow. You did? Yeah, we did a, we did a few. The kids did a few. Did they One like of it? them actually turned out funny. Did they, All right, did so they this, like Mad Libs? This is the legit Mad Libs. Yeah, we Libs. did it in the car. Nice. And this is actually, it looks like it is definitely the same company that 
uh, when this we were kids. That uh, yeah, they used to do the their thing. Mad Libs. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, right. so here we go. Getting started off with uh, our solar system. We've got. Uh, well, you've already given us now something that we have to. Edgigadev. But you're already going to know it's whoever outer gives space. me one first. Either one of you. That's a good point. Sweaty. Sweaty. Gross. Well, that's two adjectives. I'm going to need another uh, adjective. Sweaty. Stop. Come on. <laughs> um, I don't know. Uh, Balmy. Ooh, Balmy. B A L M Y. Made me think clammy. All right, Tony, noun. Clam. <laughs> Sarah. So many original thoughts. Plural noun. Said. Potatoes. Clams. All right, uh, adverb, Tony. That's a verb ending in L-Y. <laughs> that is like. correct. All right. Um, flaccidly, go. Ooh. Yeah. And then I need a, a verb ending in I-N-G, Sarah. Squirting. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, now I need a, uh, oh, this will be perfect for Tony. Silly words. <laughs> Farfuck Nugan. <laughs> uh, plural. Farfuck Nugans. Fucking grooving. <laughs> Far from puking. <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm, I don't know how to spell this, so I understand pooping. that my fin- spelling here. Phonetically. Well, considering phonetic. that you're going to be the one reading it, I guess. Oh, right? okay. Am I? Enjoy. Find me pooping. <laughs> yes. uh, we need an adjective. Blue. Blue. Ballistic. Blue. Whatever. Uh, f- first name of someone. John Donson. <laughs> is that his first name? It is now. Poor John. Uh, plural Seven. noun. Plural noun. Cigarettes. Hmm. That's a good one. Not good, but good one. Not, not good, but good for you. Uh, I need a number and not your phone number. <clears throat> and not your social security number. Oh, really? Oh, what do you do with that? 42. It's the, the answer for everything. Answer to the universe, yeah. There you go. Yeah. Oh, Adjective. Like Sorry, I'm picking them all up. Go ahead. Adjective. Um, squirmy. No. Squirm. Adjective. Squirm. Squirm. Okay. Oh. Squirm or squirmy? That's squirmy. 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 squirmy would have to be. All right, we're almost there. Uh, I need yet another first name. This time, you, Sarah. Orlando. Holy shit. Oh, this is going to be interesting. Orlando. Orlando. What about Ann Lando? Are you, are you, are you ready for this? I'm so ready. Wait, Tony, we, first name. Tony. <laughs> Sarah, first name. Steve. Sarah. Tony, first name. How can I help you? Oh. Um. Greg? I don't know. Sarah, first name. Oscar? Oscar, I like that. That's good. Tony. Hi, how can I help you? First (laughs) name. Tyler. Ooh. And uh, I'm going to give this last one to Sarah. First name. Plural noun. Plural noun. Plural Plural name. Plural noun. Um, Rockets. Rockets, man. You do understand that that A actually may work. Oh, you want me to do a different one? Nope, too late. damn it. Too late. How too late. dare you make something that makes something something. Oh. All right, so here we go. From the actual Mad Libs, uh, this one is called Our Solar System. I am reading this. Is that correct? Yeah, or go do for you, it. do one of you guys want I, to read you, it? You, okay. you, take you go, it. girl. <laughs> when we look up into the sky <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. on a oh sweaty God. summer night, mm. we see millions of tiny spots of light. Each one represents a calm, which Colostomy. a clam rather. A clam, okay. Each one represents a clam, <laughs> which is in the center of a balmy solar system, with dozens of potatoes revolving around facetly distant distant sun. <laughs> Sometimes these suns expand and begin. I can't read my own writing. Jordashing, <laughs> squirreling. Sure. Squirming? Squirting? Squirting. 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 Was, was that one of them? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, good job. Uh, sometimes these suns yeah. expand and begin squirting their Like Dr. Oh. Pimple Popper. Oh, barf. Soon they will become so big, Mm-mm. they will turn into Farvignugans. Ooh. Eventually, mm. they subside and become blue giants or perhaps black cigarettes. <laughs> 
<laughs> our own planet, which we call Smurf. John Donson. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Circles John Donson. around our squirmy sun 42 times every year. Oh. 42 oh, times. That's wow. just it. Wow. That's a, it's it's okay. 42 much. times. Just 42. Okay. There are other planets in our solar system, of course. They are named... Oh, boy. Orlando. Oh. Yes. Ding. Tony. Ding. <laughs> Steve. Ding. So many moons. Greg. Ding. Rings. Oscar. Ding. Hot gases. Tyler. <laughs> Jupiter. Oh, wait. That's actually legit. And oh. Mars. Oh. Wow. They really dropped the ball Ooh. on that one. And the scientists... Send it back. And the scientists who studied these planets, they are called... Hoovers. You don't remember your last word? Rockets! 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 Rocket Man! Woo! Whatever comes up after that. Burning no. up these scenes oh. out here Dude. alone. Burning all your hair off. What? <laughs> all right. On that happy note. That was fun, actually. Thank you, good. Sarah, for picking oh, those up. Welcome. We will have to actually we'll have to try that again down the road. Another one, another time. Sometime. Another day. But for now. <laughs> This has been a long episode. <laughs> Another episode of yeah, this did go a little <laughs> bit long. We so, went on for a long journey. It's it's a disco. Day. You you had a lot of talking to catch up on. Yeah, you did. I did. I, and you let me catch it weeks. up, and I appreciate it. Good and I'm you. stuck on the mic. Um, hey, if you want to reach us by email, you can do that by do emailing. <laughs> we don't want your email, your dirty emails. We want your rocket email. No, no, we I don't. Email. I, I do there want is a better podcast at gmail.com. Yeah. You can uh, tweet us at. There is a better in the number one. Uh, you can catch us on the Tagram. And his mouth is full. There is a better. Something you go. about Jar Jar Binks, yeah. Uh, <laughs> until next time. Uh, this is Sarah. That's Tony. I'm this D-Lo. Is, that's D-Lo. You can like us. You can love us. You can hate us. But one way or the other, we are proof that... Hey, better, podcast. better podcast. podcast. Kids Woo! in the hall. Wow. These are the Daves I know. I know. <laughs> These are the Daves I know. So the Daves I know. These are the Daves I know. Ah. I ain't got shit. Dave. Dave. Daves I know. Dave. Do, do, do. Dave. On the way home, I bought a puppy. <laughs> and then I ate him. I'm joking. I'm just kidding. I'd I never, never buy, buy you a, a puppy. puppy. <laughs>